On the stroke of nine, the red light will come on and we shall go live to the nation. I speak to you for the first time as Prime Minister. Being given the opportunity to play Winston Churchill, come in every day and you go, I can't believe I'm so fortunate to be doing this. We shall defend our island, whatever the cost may be. Gary more than delivered um, on this movie. He blew my mind on a very regular basis. You have an enormous task ahead of you. Mm, I only hope it's not too late. Gary Oldman is really an actor's, actor's, actor. I couldn't imagine the transformation would be that extraordinary. Now go. Go? No. Be... Be what? Be yourself. Gary is just such a, an actor that just transforms in every role. He's to the point where he's unrecognizable. It's like being in the room with Churchill. And I kind of have forgotten what Gary looks and sounds like. It's uncanny. This is the closest I'll ever get to being in a room with Churchill. Are you not afraid? Most cheddar. I completely forget Gary underneath. I can't really remember what he looks like, actually. <laughs> I think he's one of the great actors. Prime Minister, Prime Minister. He does it without any comment. There he is, living in flesh and blood embodiment. He is truly wonderful. It's the genius of Gary Oldman, the dedication to his craft and the hours and hours and hours of work that he has put in, that he is able to be so completely involved. It's so exciting to be in a scene with him because it's so real and so bold. For without victory, there can be no survival.